Welcome back to the channel everyone. In today's video we're going to be replacing part of the sun visor on my MGTF. So for anyone that owns an MGTF, they'll know that these sun visors can be pretty flimsy. Some of you might also remember that one of the first videos that I ever did on this channel was to replace the spring here, which keeps the sun visor open. Um, now these springs can go missing quite easily, uh, which is what happened with mine when I picked up the car, and you can get replacement springs. Um, but the, um, the modification we're gonna do in today's video should, um, should solve that problem. So the sun visor strips that we're going to be fitting to the car are these, and these are um, from solo 3d print and design uh, they were sent to me by tim norman um, you can find their shop on ebay and i'll pop a link in the description below for where you can find them um, now what they are is a just a, a simple replacement for the original one so that where the original's got a spring to open that sun visor and then it keeps it open and we mentioned earlier about how it's easy to sometimes lose that spring the difference with this design is that it has a sliding mechanism instead um, so it should just be a simple replacement to the original, so we're gonna get the old sun visors out and then we'll put these ones in. So the first thing that we need to do in order to replace the sun visor strip is to take the sun visors off. I find that it's easier to do it, to do this job if you take them out rather than trying to do it whilst they're still in the car. Um, and all you need to do in order to do that is remove the two Phillips screws that are just underneath the sun visors on each side. So we're going to get the screwdriver out and then we're going to do that now. In the box, when it arrives from, um, from Solo 3D Printing Design, you get some instructions and then as well as these instructions, you're also going to get a little yellow 3D printed pry bar. Um, so what you'll need to do, um, now we've got the um, sun visors off um, and into the garage, is take off this old mechanism. So um, obviously follow the instructions. Um, and the first step is to put the pry bar underneath this little bit here. Um, and then we're gonna work our way around. And you'll see actually it's quite helpful on the new one that arrives um, you can see where the clips are so there's four clips that you're looking to um, remove um, so you'd be aiming to put the um, the pry bar under each corner the lever in each one, one off one by one until they're all off and then we can take them off and then put the new one on There we have it, the new sliding sun visor strips are fitted already. Um, that literally took probably about 20 seconds per sun visor. Um, so we'll get these fitted back in the car and I'll give you my first thoughts on what they're like. So we're back in the car and literally putting these back in is a reverse of what we did before. Um, so I'll quickly get those put back in um, and then we'll have a look at what they're like. So here they are refitted to the car. Um, now, they certainly solve the problem of uh, replacing that spring. So you're never gonna um, have an issue with worrying about losing that spring anymore. Um, the actual look and feel of these is really impressive. Um, to think that you can make all of these using 3D printing now is it's just incredible. Um, the finish is really similar to the finish that you find um, on the trims around the window. Um, the mechanism slides nicely across um it doesn't lock in place um but it does 
hold quite nicely so i don't think it's going to run the risk of particularly sliding back that way um it in comparison to the original sun visor i wouldn't say it particularly makes the sun visor any wider than it was before so you're not going to get any more more sun protection than you had with the original um, which i know is a common complaint with owners of mgfs and tfs that the sun visors don't give them that much sun protection now this isn't going to solve that issue for you um i think you would need to um look at replacing the whole sun visor altogether and i think there are people out there that have done something similar replacing these with um bmw i think they're z3 sun visors um but i think it's it's really impressive um as i said really like these really look oem just like the original so there we are the sun visors are refitted to the car um hopefully you found this video quite helpful in terms of um what's out there um for parts to replace broken bits on your mgtf really clever stuff what people are doing so again big shout out to tim at um, solo 3d pr printing and design um, if you're missing those springs on your sun visors this could be something that might help you with that so if you found today's video interesting and helpful please consider giving the video a like down below and subscribing to the channel if this is the kind of video that you want to see more of in the future and until next time i'll see you soon Thank you.